Car number 235-988-2001 Lexus IS300. It's the first one of these that we've done. So fairly light front end hit here. Lots that are in, is intact there still. Let's do a walk around here. Pretty clean car on the inside. Automatic transmission. The exhaust sticking out here quite a bit. Don't know if these have a button or what to get to the trunk. Whatever it is, I can't find it very quickly here for the video, so I'm sure it had a wing sitting on the back here. So this car does run and drive. We'll open the hood up here real quick. So coming into this car, let's uh, put the key in here. And so this car, let's see if I can turn the lights on so you can see the gauge cluster a little better. It's 143,282 for miles. So we're gonna start this car. We'll leave those lights at least to that stage. So the fan belts are squeaking in there. So we're gonna go into drive right away to show that this thing does move on its own power. Going to reverse, same thing. So again, it does run and drive. We'll wrap it here, it'll probably squeal. So that belt's just clamped in there, so we're gonna shut this down and uh, turn it on and try to check as much as else is that we can, or much else that we can check. So wipers are working. Sprayers are working. Left turn signal, right turn signal. You can see the brights turning on out in front there. Um, turn the lights on. Let's see if we get those wipers off. So it looks like our lights are turning on. I can see the reflection in that garbage can there. Um, let's see what else we have. Here's our illumination for the dash. Look a little dark in that bottom corner, maybe. Otherwise, pretty good. Turn the lights off here. Let's go to HVAC. So we do have things switching on their own so that's working so our climate control is working our hazards are working um let's try windows our door locks here there's our driver side actuator looks like we've got all our actuators working um let's try our windows driver's window works Passenger window works. Our rear passenger works. You can hear the, oh, there we go, just hasn't been done in a long time. So our rear passenger works as well. Looks like we got a sunroof. Let's see. I don't have it open. Okay, so that's our vent position. Works. Okay, here's our open and close. So that's working. Battery's a little low in this car. Very low, because now it's dying. I mean, let's see if we can get it started again. Nope. <laughs> so we just lost the battery. So let's see if we can get this to shut. Moving a lot faster now. Fresh jump pack. Let's try our mirrors. Left side mirror, everything is working. 
right side mirror, everything's working. Power seats. Left side moves forward and back. Moves up, moves down. Tilt is moving back. Tilt moves forward. Let's see if these are power as well. They are. Reverse, forward, tilt back, tilt forward, up and down. So it looks like all that works. Looks like our transmission controls for snow and for power are all there. There's a little switch that we have here that I don't know what it's for. I'm sure we'll figure that out. Other than that, um, I think we've tested everything. So again, this is a 2001 Lexus IS300 with 143,000 miles. Car number 235988. Parts available on our website, www.playgroundpar.com or our eBay store, Playground Par.